We are live for fans at stadium to watch the Power Eels take on the Canberra Raiders and what will be an anticipated clutch in a series of trial games. Both sides are looking pretty tough out there. Raiders made a pretty good signings and the Eels made a couple of key signings to fix their lineup. They're trying to keep everyone else together. We're going to have a pretty good lineup there and they're all going to go to battle here. And I'm looking forward to this game. I'm going to figure it's going to be a very interesting game. Don't know who's gonna win. I'm gonna tip. I'll tip the Raiders for now, but it could be the power and upset. So they run out here. I'm interested to see who takes it from here. Raiders have made quite a few signings this off season, including signing Jesse Tabalon, who's been named their captain, and signing a couple other players. A couple of a key forwards, such as, you know, we got Tevedo Hang on Junior signed. We'll get to some, we'll get to them later. Hamster Tapu off at all, just had a calf, we've come crossed over to them. So about to kick off now and it goes down to the gut of Jack Warren take it up here to give it to Christian Wells to take the first step of this game. Alright, they're gonna play the ball here. First tackle now. Goes a little bit of a juggle there. I thought they might have been a knock on. Say so play on. Jack Wyden, out the back to challenge the clock start. Josh Wyden now pushes forward. Both tackle now. A good little kick there by Jamal Fogarty, the new Raiders player. The Raiders halfback, he goes for the touch there. Can't find it. But the Raiders are going to be on the attacking from the uh from just over from the 20 minute line. The Eels will be sorry. Great little kick there by um the Raiders halfback. Just short of 40 20. That was a 40 20 but I would have been dangerous for the Eels to start this game. Goes out to Clint Gufston though, who takes it there. Just in front of the 20 meter line now. Plays the ball, first tackle. Goes Nelson to suffer Solomona. He pushes forward. Second tackle. Goes Charles Little Clockstad. Clint Gufferson. Out to Mitchell Moses. First tackle there. Good run. Dummy and run there with Mitchell Moses. They're going to short side here. Inside board and Nickel. Um, Gufferson. He can't get through. Fourth tackle now. What are we going to do? And it's going to be a knock on there around Madison. That went for the short ball, I think, but he's juggled it. Tip the deck. And Raiders are going to get good field position. 35 metres out from the Eels trial line. Good job there by the Eels. is widened. Takes it forward there. First tackle now. Goes through our Fogarty. Inside ball to Jason Tabalolo. Takes like a good short side. Fogarty, the clock set. Out to Adokar. Just had a couple of great run there. He pushes forward Papali. He, you know, short ball fair to Jabal Fogarty. He pushes forward, I think he's over. Jabal Fogarty has got his Raiders color in this Paramount versus Raiders trial game. Looks like he pushes forward. And as he get there, I think he's over. Yes, he's over. No denying him from there. And Jamal Fogarty dubbies and then up pushing his way over the line. Great try by the Raiders. And the Raiders start getting a try early here. At ANZ Stadium. Sack Lomax. I don't that new recruit's going to be goal kicking for them. This is a lot of things up, but he's going to get it all there. Good kick. And Mr. Moses is going to line things up to get things back on the way here. And Mr. Moses kicks off here. Back on the way here as Raiders 
Could he catch it there by Jarrell Fogarty for try score and give it over to Christian Walsh to take the hit up? Another one of the new recruits from the Raiders. First tackle now. It's going to go Fogarty. Fogarty for a gap. For some space. Second tackle now. Lyden. Out to tackle Lomax. Off on the inside to Christian Walsh. Shop of Eddie Papali, E. Papali, E. Fourth tackle now. Goes Christian Walsh, looking for some space. Pops of one. Two from another. Gets it off with there. Great run there by Christian Walsh. Fifth tackle now. What are we going to do here? Goes one. B for today. It's going to be taken there. But how much I tap you off when I can't get the offload off? And the Eels survive an onslaught of attack. First tackle now. Mahoney gives it to Moses. He gives it out to Dane Gagai, one of the new recruits here. After he was sacked by the Knights. Long ball over there. It's going to be intercepted by Tavita Pangai Jr. out of all players. He was going on the attack again. I'm ready to go on the attack again. Eels, what are they doing here? Another poor error. They haven't yet to be able to complete a set. And second tackle now. They need to find something for the Eels. Shuffle there to fa Fogarty. Fogarty pushes forward. Third tackle now. Go shuffle there to Politi. He pushes forward. Fourth tackle. We're looking to go left. If they don't go right. Shuffle there. Oh no, so they do go left. They go wide and pulls up. Just short of the thing there. Tom Starling tries to scoot and great defense by the Eels. Nice Raiders. And the Eels survive somehow. Great defense there was there by the Eels as Walker Blake takes it up there. First tackle. Second tackle now. Where are we going to go? We're going to go Mahoney to triple that of Wally. Poorly with a bit. Poorly with a big run. It's going to go Harris Davina, short ball there to Papali'i. Both, both Papali'i's on there today. It's going to go all the way back to Harris Davina, punt it forward. It's got a good kick, not the right angle though. But it's taken there. One o'clock clock stat. And he's straight for a gap. He gets past one. I thought it was through from Mahoney with a great cover tackle. If he, Mahoney wasn't there, he would have ran probably about 110 metres. Christian Welsh pushes forward. Second tackle. There's Fogarty. Short ball there. Tamalolo. And short side again. Over to Hamaso Tabio Fano. Taken on the fullback. He gets taken there. A great run. The clock that steps one and gets taken there. What are we going to do? 50 minutes gone in this one. Raiders lead 6 0. Hunted high. No one's really there to take it. It's taken by Clint Gufferson. But he's going to be dragged back into the end goal. And the Raiders will get another set on the Parramatta Hills line. They're going to get no field position here, Parramatta. And once again, they haven't left their 40. And once again, they're going to be, well, defending their line. It's going to be, this will be their third set defending the line. That one trying the first time, second time they got denied. <clears throat> what happened this time? This goes to Tumble he pushes forward. The shorts are widened. Out to Rapina. Rapina looking for some space. He can't find any. It's gonna go Tumalolo. Inside ball. Christian Welsh. Fourth tackle now. Short ball there to Papali'i. Can't do anything about it. Fifth tackle now. Goes high. And it's going to be Walker Blake, but it's going to be dragged back in the end goal. Good catch there. But the Raiders' defense says, that's fine. We'll just go again. The Parramatta also had no ball in the second half. On first half, none. None to start this game. They had one completed set. And, well, Nicole Hoxton nearly ran the full length there.
if it wasn't caught by Rick Mahoney. Goes through the clock stat, gives it a pop, Pelitti. He pushes forward. First tackle now. Raiders leading 6 0 once again. Bogarty, dummies in a runs. Up past the 30 meter line now, second tackle. Tomalola gives it out to Wyden. Jack Wyden pushes forward, third tackle now. Go short side. Out to Rupert. Rupert gets past one. He must score here. No. Clint Gufferson stops him. Meters short of the try line. Centimeters in for short ball there. And it's going to be picked up by Nathan Brown. An error from the Raiders. It's going to be run 40 meters before being stopped. Or 35 meters. Whatever you want to say. First tackle now. How did the Raiders. He will survive that. Will Pedersini gets off. Gets it off on the inside. But it's scored forward. They finally make a pass that 40 meter line with a great run from Will Pedersini. Offloads it. That's a tough call there. I don't, think, I don't know if that was forward there. And over there. As now, once again, the Raiders are going to have good field position to start this their set. Zach Lomax plays it there. Goes Fogarty. Short ball there to Vanapango Jr. A big, powerful run by the second rower. The new Raiders recruit plays it there. Goes short there to Tumalola. He plays it there. Third tackle now. Goes out to Elliot Whitehead. He plays it. Good run there by the second rower. Here's short side there. Out to Rupert Rapida. He's looking for some space. Gets taken down, five meters out. Again. Goes to Starling, he puts an eye. Hit back. Taken there by Mitchell Moses. We know how fast he is. He's away. Over to 40. 30, no one's in front of him. He's going to run the length of the field. Mitchell Moses. And somehow, Pavanel is going to be kicking. Tie things up. The Raiders put all this pressure on them. But a knockback gone completely wrong. And then up in the hands of Mitchell Moses. Who's run 90 metres. 95 metres potentially, I think it might have been. Score under the upright. And we'll now be kicking his, the converter's own try to make it a 6 all game. What a try. What a time to score it. And I don't know how Power Rangers are still in this game. Then the Raiders have had 5 sets on the try line. Or something ridiculous like that. But they've only considered... And Power Rangers have only considered one try. Feels like all the kicks, apart from the first one, has been attacking from the Raiders. Have been an attacking kick. Yet, yeah, it's 6-all. Power Rangers was having got yet not got tackled inside the 40. Yet, yeah, it is 6-all. How long have took it outside, the, outside their own 40, sorry. Six swords, look at her down there. Supposed to hex it up, give it over to Kim Gillard. I don't know how. It's tied here. It does not deserve to be a tied game. Yet it is. Goes over to Mitchell Moses. He gets taken there. Just from the 20 minute line here. Goes Madison, he rushes forward. Third tackle now. Sean Lane pushes forward. Good run there by the. He's just come on. Usually he plays second row lock. He's come on here today and he's playing prop though. They're going to punt it. Not the best kick by Aris Davini. It's going to stay in. But it's going to go not even past the 40 I think. Wasn't the best kick. Maybe we were looking for his wing to chase it or something. But either way, just never got a mark. And yeah, well, if, they hit, if he'd done it a bit shallower, how much of Tabby Offaloe could have got it? It's going to go Nico Klockstad. He takes it there. First tackle. Raiders will need to be the next score. As LIA pushes forward. They cannot let them concede again. Considering how much ball they've had. Anything but a good lead at half time will be disappointing for the Raiders coach. Third tackle now. Shut down half. Gives it over. Widen. Widen through a gap. Good run by Elliot Whitehead. 
Looking for some space. Fourth tackle now. It's gonna go. Tries to go clock stand, looking for some gaps. He's picked it up and dropped back. Five meters out now. We're gonna drop it through. Take a bow, Campbell Gillard. And the Raiders survive. Second tackle now. Plays the ball. Mahoney. Short ball Veda Harris to Vida. Sorry, Sean Lane. My bad. Harris Vida. Short ball Veda Sean Lane. Third tackle. How are we right? It was still in this game. The Raiders had so much ball in this first half. Where it deserved to be. 30 million is gone. I want to be surprised at their possession rate. It's shocking. They charge it down. But taken down by Nathan Brown. He pushes the spot. Could run by Nathan Brown. Finally, they tackled outside their 40. He plays it there. Goes back to Mitchell Moses who punts it forward. It's going to be taken there or up and off. And he's taken there on the 30 meter line now. First tackle. Short ball there. A massive shot put on one of the Raiders players. And he was going to have a full position inside their own half. Moses scoots up now. What a good couple of last five, ten minutes here for the it was in the Raiders. It just fallen apart. Despite all this possession I've had in the first 25 minutes. Now goes Mahoney. Nathan Brown. Short ball available for Lee. He must score. Raiders defenders offside. He can't make contact with him. And Papali is going to score. Now he was going to potentially kick him. To increase their lead. That is a try. Every day of the week. Couldn't keep him up. Storm Starling was offside. And the Raiders. How are they not in front? And how are they now behind by six? Or four, sorry, but it'll be six in a second. As now Mitchell Moses is going to be kicking. And he gets the goal. The score is now 12 6. How are Ra Raiders behind now? They had so much ball in the first 25 minutes, and it's all gone to waste of only getting one try. And he was firing with two quick ones. Kick up now, goes down to Clint Gufferson, gives it over to Campbell Gillard, who takes it up there. First tackle now. Goes for Feliti, he pushes forward. Second tackle, Sean Lane. Short ball there to Reagan Campbell Gillard. Plays it there, third tackle, good run there. Inside ball, Clint Gufferson. Gets it off for now. Chad has to be the off on the inside. Nathan Brown, a good run there. Heels. None of them score again here, Raiders. Goes out to Popoliti. He pushes forward. Fifth tackle now. Nathan Brown punts it forward. I don't know why he's kicking, but it's going to be taken there by Rafa. And he steps past one before being taken 15 minutes out from their own try line. The Raiders have been falling apart here as Elliot Wider gets away. Offloads there, Josh Alia pushes forward. Second tackle now. Wider. Short ball there to Elliot Whitehead. Goes out to Zach Lomax. He pushes forward. Fourth tackle now. Short ball there. Stop Starling's away. Fifth tackle now. And they're going to knock it on there, Raiders. And now covers it to I. Short lane, sorry. Short lane to I. And now Fire's going to run. He's going to run all the way back up to the 40 meter line. And now the Raiders. Um, it was going to show them the attack. Could, imagine if they scored just before half time. They'll get probably about a set. Just less, less than one. Goes out to Gufferson. He's taken there. 
Curtis Harris to Vina. Short ball there, but it's going to be intercepted by Tamalolo. First tackle now. And it goes out to Tevano Hanko Jr. He's straight for a gap. Off foot back on the inside to Tom Starling. Raiders need his goal just for half time to make up, even up the scoreline. Goes over to Elliot Whitehead. He pushes forward. They'll probably get one or two last plays. It's 45 for the half now. But it's going to go. Fogarty. Offload. Tom Starling. He pushes forward. He's not going to be able to make it there. And we are going to go off to the break. The Raiders behind against the Eels. 12 points to 6. And we are back here in the second half. Now, if you're wondering, despite all the possession the Eels had to end the half, which is still probably 50 50 the Raiders, the Eels have 38% of the ball compared to 61 no, 39% of the ball compared to 61% by the Raiders. Who knows? It would have been 70 75% for the Raiders in the first 25 minutes. As this Nelson of Solomon pushes forward to make the first 10 up of the half. The new. Paramount recruit. A bit of a quiet and I haven't seen much of him. But he's one of the new ones. It goes Brown. Short ball there and Marilyn Rokore. Second tackle now. He they're gonna go short side. Paulo. Inside ball to Gufferson. Paulo ball playing. We know he has the ball playing system of a halfback. He's just a big boy. And third tackle now. It's gonna go Brown. Brown straight through a gap there. Tries to get the offload, but it's gonna go to ground and picked up by Wyden. And now the Raiders go straight on to the attack. Harawi Har Naira pushes forward. Second tackle. It's going Whiten. Short ball there. Tom Lolo. Third tackle now. And it goes Corey Harawi Naira. He pushes forward. Fourth tackle now. They're going to try to get offload. And what a great pass. I thought that was backwards. They're going to say it went forward. Controversial decision here. Probably very unlucky there. A ball had gone off. It probably would have ended up being a try. In the corner for Hammer. So, Tabby I Fido, he is a quick boy. I don't know if Clint Gobson was going to get to him. So he'd already been in the winger. But, nonetheless... The Eels survive. Another good set by the Raiders. After this time, an error. And now the Raiders are going to be... Now the Eels, sorry. They're going to going back on the attack. Look at just trying to make some space here. Hopefully he pushes forward. Third tackle now. Mahoney looks for some space. Goes Brown. Short ball. Bit of a juggle there by Moses and... Can't tell that it is. Might have been Papali or Neo Kore, one or the other. Yeah, it was Neo Kore. Juggle up there. It's hit one of the, both their hands and it hit the ground. And now the Raiders once again go on the attack. I don't know how to have this boss possession. 61% it'd probably be. I don't reckon it would have changed. And they're behind by six. It just shows how brilliant the defense of the Paramount is. So, but the start of this game, Nick Hawk's dead. Get to the backfield. Take it down by Clint Gobson. A great run there. But it took a great tackle to stop. And they're going to go short ball there to the Tamalolo. He's so close. I thought he was over for sure there. How do they stop him that close? They're going to go out. Back. Hopefully he pushes forward. They don't stop him from there. Surely he's over there. The ref says we'll have a look at this one. They say no try. Parallel defenders in the way. The going up says they said no try. I thought surely there was a player of grass touching that ball there. We're going to say no try though. Bit of a hard angle to really see it on to be fair. As they go high. Fogarty. Big boot high here. Tap back. This time it lands in the arms of Cl Clockstad. But he's taken there pretty quickly. Wrapped up by the Eels defenders. And they once again 
Swarm up the onslaught of attack. I scuff him with a big run. Take it up here on the 30 meter line. First tackle now. Inside ball. Nathan Brown once again the way he's been excellent today for the Eels. Second tackle now. It's going to go over to Isaiah Papaliti. Third tackle now. Brown looking for some space. Dylan Brown with a big run. Fourth tackle now. It's going to go over to Nelson to Solomon Solomon with a big run. Fifth tackle now. It's going to go that Dylan Brown who puts it on. It's going to go Nick Hogstad in step one before being taken there just in front of the 10 meter line. And somehow it. And the Raiders survive another one. But how in the Power Man Eels still in front by six? Like. This has been the story of the night. Their defense has been absolutely incredible. It has to crack it up. What is the best of shots we put on? We're going to say play on the interesting decision. Chris Walsh though takes it up. Third tackle now. Long ball over to Aaron Aaron. Fourth tackle now. Inside ball to Tamalolo. Can't find anywhere space there. Been a bit quiet today, Tamalolo, if I do say so myself. Of course, it's just the trial game, as I did mention. They're going to kick long here, though. But Walker Blakes takes it there. Palms off one for being taken there. He's going to get tracked pretty close to the touch line. He's taken it and they're going to give away a penalty now, right? This is not what they need. They don't deserve to win, right? With how much ball they've had. Should be in front by about... Realistically, they could be in front 24 to 6 here. 30 to 6. But instead... They're behind by six. So goes Paulo out to Nathan Brown. First tackle now. Moses, Gufferson, out to Walker Blake, looking for some space. Gets taken there on the 30 meter line. Plays the ball. Play on the wing here. Goes Mahoney. Short ball there to Paulo. A big runs over to one of them. Take a boy tackle from behind him. They're going to short ball there. Gufferson steps one. Take it there. Fourth tackle. They must score here. Could you imagine? Will Panasini push back? Knocked over in a big tackle there. Fifth tackle now. We need to find some space though. Dylan Brown grabs it through and Gufferson scores a brilliant try. And the Parramatta Eels extend their lead. Despite all these sets, the Raiders have attacked on their line. How the hell? Are the Raiders now going to be behind by 12? A great try there. Never going to catch him. And he just picked it from the from the from midair and went over and grounded it. And now Mitchell Moses is going to kick it to make it an 18 6 scoreline. Zach Lomax is going to kick off now. Sofa Solomon pushes forward. First tackle now. Mahoney gives it to Dylan Brown. Short ball there to Paulo. He pushes forward. Second tackle. Suffer Solomona, look for some space. He can't find any. Big run there by the X Storm prop. Now, Kurt, as as I was saying that though, Raiders make a massive knock, um, massive shot. Get the ball. 
And now they're in the Paramount Eels in goal again. Can the Eels survive another set? Find out. Goes to Tarpany. He pushes forward. Third tackle now. It's good to have done me half by Tom Starling. Can't find any space. Fogarty dummies and runs. Fifth tackle now. They go short for one and can't get a kick away. I don't know if he knows his last. He's not. He's taking there five meters out. What's he doing? They need to find points and not be left in the end goal. As Paul, a bit of a weird pass out dummy half. Goes behind them all, but Paul picks it up for making his way up to the 15 meter, 10 meter line. Goes out. Pup, Papa Lee finds a bit of. gets his head through the space, but can't get his full body through. Long ball over. Off on the inside to Reed Mahoney. Third tackle now. They need to find something here. Right, they need to get the ball back somehow. Good for position. Fourth tackle. If I was primarily also, I'd be taking it to a fifth tackle. They get to go for the 40 20, in fact. The poor kick. Taken there by Nickel Clockstad. And again, the Raiders go on the attack. Can they score this time? Or will this time be turned around? However. How many eels still in this with how many errors they've given away? How much field position they've given away? Ghost of Lolo. Short ball there to Hadawira Naira. Third tackle now. 19 minutes remaining in this game. Paramount Eels 18-6 against the Raiders. Short ball there to Elliot Whitehead. Fourth tackle now. Long pass over to Whiten. Whiten can't get through. Fifth tackle now. We need to find something here. Goes back to Tabalolo. He, out of all plays, he puts it high. This kick B. It's taken by Wagga Blake. And once again, he works his way out of the end goal. Let's get driven back. And in fact, they even give away a penalty. <sighs> Raiders, what are they doing? There's the kick for touch. 18 to 6 up. The Eels are. And I'll start the set on the 20 meter line after the penalty they give, the Raiders gave away. Nathan Brown pushes forward. First tackle now. Ryan Madison and a big shot put on. Good shot there. Reed Mahoney goes. Brown. Short ball there to Papaliti. Third tackle now. Goes Nathan Brown inside ball. Nathan Brown pushes forward. Fourth tackle now. Dylan Brown, at the back to Marcus Sivo. He takes it there. Dylan Brown punts it forward. A good kick there. It's going to be taken by Josh Adakar. First tackle now. First short side. A bit of interesting play. Bogarty now. Take it just to front of the 30 meter line. Raiders, they did find something to get up the other end. I don't know how they're behind by so much. We'll talk about considering how much ball they've had. Adekar, I don't know if he's touched it all game, in fact, Adekar. Takes it there, though. Tarpany. Fourth tackle now. Good run there by Joseph Tarpany. Fogarty. Dummies and runs before getting taken there. Fifth tackle now. As Jason Tamalolo punts it over. A big punt there by the uh, block forward. I don't know why he's punting it once again, but the Eels take it there. Can the Raiders have any opportunity to come back here? Could Gufferson up the middle? Second tackle. Moses. Over. Dylan Brown. Third tackle now. Let's go short side. Marcus Silva takes it there. Fourth tackle now. It's going to go over to Isaiah Papaliti. He pushes forward. Fifth tackle now. They need something if he heals. And they need to get over here. It goes over there. Dylan Brown punts it forward. Over to Jordan Rapp. And he's looking like he looks looking for a gap. Gets taken there on the 20 meter line. Short ball there. And they're looking for something. 
The Raiders. I don't know how they're still behind. But then, Raiders have a few things to look at within terms of their attack. As they felt. But it could have, maybe it was just the Bruins of Deal's defense. Short ball there, Ellie Whitehead. Fourth tackle now. Jack White looking for some space. Gets a long ball over to Pangai Jr. Fifth tackle now. A long kick away. Gets down to the gun of Wagga Blake. It's taken by them. Gets past the 30 meter line. As Martin and Nerecore is away. Good run there. Gets it off to the Ribahoni. Could they go with another one? Could you imagine they get another one here? Second tackle now. Brown. Obviously, if we, the possession rate would have even up by now, but I reckon Raiders would still be leading by quite a bit. I reckon about 40 60. Screw another one. Well, that would just seal the game right there. Fourth tackle now. They need something here. The Raiders. They didn't force an error here. Fifth tackle now. What are they going to do? Brown puts it high. A big kick. Taken there by Zach Lomax. And he can only work his way up to the 10 meter line. A little short ball there. Trying to find something here. Elliot Whitehead. He can't do anything with it though. Raiders, they need something. Short ball there. Bring on a short ball. But they had covered the fence already coming around and make top make tackle on Tarpany. Another short ball. This time double. They managed to get through this time. But comforts is there to make tackle. They need to find a try now. They want any chance to come back in this trial game. They need to try this set. Short ball there. And Joseph Tarpany's throw cap. Gets the offload. Jack Wyden. Pushes up 15 meters out now. They need to this play. Now nothing for the Raiders. Fogarty puts it high. And Clumpus is under it. It was too deep in the end. And in the end, the Parramatta Eels survive. And that might just about sell us for tonight. Or today, this afternoon. Plays the ball now. Harris to be the short ball there to Isaiah Papali'i. First tackle now. Moses. Out to near Corey. Looking for a gap there, Nathan Brown. Can't find anything. Madison looking for some space. A good run there. But a second row off. And they go on to Clint Gustafson. He steps back on the inside. And that's going to do us no. He can't score. Gets off the remote. He might be able to score. And he does. And that's going to seal us for the Eels. The Raiders have had so much possession on the Eels line. So much ball. Yet they're going to lose by potentially 18. Gufferson made some breaks. Made a break there. Got around the fullback. Offload to Mahoney. And the Eels, the Parramatta Eels, are in. They've made their mark. They've made a statement here tonight. Or this afternoon, sorry. Most is going to be kicking it to make a 24-6 scoreline. As he lines up. And he's got it nicely. Can anyone believe what's just going on here? And Zach Lomax is going to line back up. Okay, okay there's only two minutes from minute training. The game's done for them. Goes down the cup, so he gives it a channel Harris. The Vader and a big shot's put on there. They're not happy with how they've gone. Goes Brown. They're just going to run off the game now. Nikoro pushes up there. Second tackle. I believe he pushes forward. Third tackle. 50 seconds left. We're inside, outside. Inside ball. 
Guffers it away. Can't get away there. Fourth tackle now. Could you imagine to get one last try here, Eels? Short ball there to Papali'i, but that's going to bat to us there. And the Parramatta Eels have defeated the Canberra Raiders 24-6. What a game it was. And I'll be tuning out. Thank you guys for watching.